you're just a beginner in Photoshop and you want to see how epic could be your ideas and artworks, redesigned by a pro artist, welcome to this brand new series. I'll do my best to make your artworks look something more than epic. So without wasting time, let's dive in. Hello to all my YouTube friends. Welcome to this brand new episode. First of all, I'm gonna thank you all for sending to me your amazing artworks. It's really appreciated, guys. And for those who doesn't know, if you want to participate in this series, and you want to show us your artworks, and want to see how epic could be your artworks, just send your artworks to my Gmail address. I'll do my best to redesign your artworks based on your own general idea. So let's start our first episode. This piece submitted by Mahir Muin. Hey, Navid. I am a fan of yours. I recently did a design. I have attached the image. It would be really nice if I can get your feedback on it. Here's most of the photos that I used, in case you want to redesign it in a future video, because I believe there is a lot that can be done better. I would love to see that. Well, thank you so much, Mahir, for your artwork. I love the subject you've chosen, and the way you make the cracked style on the statues. Maybe you need to take some more time on making the landscape and try to add some more details there. By the way, I need to tell you guys, in general, when you're trying to start creating an artwork, be sure to have an interesting idea about it. I have an idea! You need to give a good reason to your audience to make them, see your artworks, and pleasure. Give me all your attention, mates. Pleasure after seeing the artworks is the most important part, and this is the key. So, let's redesign this piece by adding a crazy interesting story about it. Well, I start today with this underwater picture, and I select the surface area with object selection tool, and put it in the composition. So I do that again for another one, and I attach them together with warp just like that. Now it's the time to remove the edges. So I use a hard round brush and I try to remove the edges. There you go. So after that I go for the bottom edges and I try to make a soft edge with a soft round brush as you can see. So that I can blend it with this underwater picture. So I reduce its size then I create a black mask for it. After that I start painting the water area. There you go. Now it's time to match the surface area's color to the bottom. So I correct its light with exposure adjustment and its color with color balance. Here we go. Now let's add the subject in the composition. And I remove down part quickly. For the down part, I use this rock picture and I add it under the status. Then I remove extra areas with a hard round brush to attach it to the statue. There we go. So I try to match the color and light of the subject with the rocks by adding some exposure and color balance adjustments. And I start to paint the highlights very nicely to make a perfect highlight to it. As I told you in the How to Become a Legend in Photoshop video, one of the most important part of any artwork is painting highlights and casting the shadows. As you can see, I add the highlights manually and I try to make it as real as possible. Believe me guys, this will magic for you. After highlighting, I go to casting shadows, and I do it again with all my accuracy to make it epic, just like that. Well guys, you can see how can epic you can make anything, by adding the right shadows and highlights. Well after that, I go for the rocks and I add shadows to it, then I correct its color to the blue vibe, cause it's under the water, you know. And I paint the underwater area with a brush, just like that. Then I add a cloudy sky to the background and for more details. I add a city too in the depth of the composition, just like that. Well guys, here is the main general idea of the Mayhir artwork. Let's add some more extra details and add a bunch of lights and colors to it and have the final result.
Well guys, here is what I end up with. Hope you like it. This was the first episode of Redesign Your Artwork series, and I'll redesign three artworks in one episode in future. So if you want to participate in the future episodes, be sure to send your artworks to my Gmail address. Well, I guess this is the end of today's video, and I'll see you in my next video. Be safe, and keep creative.